Good afternoon, 5A. For today's writing mission, you're going to need the help of somebody uh, at home to ask you some questions about each of your subtopics. And then you're going to use those questions uh, to make sure that each of your subtopics for your informational writing piece uh, is thorough. And why this is helpful is because a lot of us chose topics that we already know quite a lot about. So when we start writing about them, we might assume some information um, that our readers have, but maybe our readers don't know as much about our topic. So this can be helpful to make sure that you cover some of that information. Uh, the topic of my informational writing piece was football. So what I did was I had, I read each of my four subtopics to Mrs. Mack, and then she asked me two questions about each subtopic. Four subtopics, two questions for each subtopic. My first subtopic for football was teams. And Mrs. Mack asked me, how many teams are there um, in the NFL? And does every state have a team? The second question was about, or the second, my second subtopic was players. Mrs. Mack asked me, how many players are on a team? And who are some of the most famous players? My third topic, subtopic, was rules. Mrs. Mack asked, what happens when you break the rules? And what are some of the most important rules? My fourth subtopic was the positions of football. And Mrs. Mack asked me, how many positions are there? And what is the most important position? So your mission today is going to be, and you'll see it attached to this assignment, there's a document for you to write down the two questions that uh, somebody asked you about each of these sub topics. This could be a parent, uh, aunt, uncle, sibling, cousin, anybody. You can even call or FaceTime someone if they don't live with you to have them ask you two questions about each of your subtopics. And if you have to wait uh, until past four o'clock until that person is home, um, that's fine too. You don't have to worry about writing down your answers to all of these questions just yet. Um, we'll take time throughout the week to do that as we write uh, about each of our subtopics. So all you have to turn in today is the two questions for every subtopic that they asked you, and you will keep that uh, with you to help you as we continue writing this week.